Hello everyone and welcome to another video in which we are going to take a look at Paw Patrol and the Crane Tower. So we got lights, we got sounds, we got music, we got everything that we need. So let's unbox this toy and have some fun. Whoa. And once we take everything out of the box, these are all the pieces in our playset. This is gonna be a very big, big crane. Wow. Here is our kinetic sand that we're gonna be working with. We have a small brown bag, which we're gonna open in just a second. And here are our instructions. And of course, we have some stickers. But what's inside of this bag? Hmm, let's check it out. I'm kind of curious, so let's check this out. Oh, we got some smaller pieces. Oh, but these look like our molds for the kinetic sand itself. So we have two molds, one which looks like this on both sides, and another one that looks like this. So in a second, I'm gonna show you how to use these. And then we have some smaller pieces right here. Like I said, this is going to be our kinetic sand. So we have a little bit that looks like a regular sand. And we have some that is this red color right here. But wait a minute. Huh. Where is rubble in all of this? Do you see him? Hmm. Let's see. Oh, I see him. Right in there. Oh, here is rubble. And this is his car, the bulldozer. Oh wow, check this one out. This is pretty neat. So it could go up and down and we also have the scoop in the back that also moves. Nice. So let's place rubble inside of the vehicle. Oh yes, now we are ready to have some fun. So let's put this crane together. But you know what, before we do that, we need to install the batteries. So let's see what we're going to need. And we need three AAA batteries. I can do that. So we got one, two, and number three. Whoa, I was not expecting that. Okay, let's close this up. Okay, and let's test this out if it works. So let's pr press on this button right here. Huh, let's bow wow build indeed. Let's put this screen together. Let's start with the stickers. Let's place all the stickers on the correct places. First, let's put the stickers on our bulldozer. So we have one that goes here. Okay, here it is. Looking a little bit better. I don't know about you, but I'm always afraid to be putting on these long stickers. I'm just afraid that it's not gonna align, but we have to be slow and gentle and... Whew, we made it. Fantastic. Now that we got all of our stickers, let's start building the crane. Okay, let's slowly start attaching everything to one another. Okay, here's one leg of our crane. Here's gonna be another one. And the back ones. Whoa, looking good. Now let's put in this bottom plate. 
snap everything into place. There we go. Three and four. Nice. Now we're going to do this top platform. So we're going to put these on the sides. Two, three. Whoa! It fell. And number four. This and then at the bottom, we're going to install this. And then we're going to place everything right here on top. Okay, we're also going to insert this piece right here on the side. And snap it into place like this. Beautiful. Okay, here we go. Our last pieces to complete the crane. This will go on top. Like this, and now we have the crane itself. So we're just going to put this end piece here and then all the way on top the crane. At this point our set is complete. So here we have Rubble and his vehicle, a bulldozer. And in the background is our crane. Check this out. Whoa, this is a really, really big crane. So up here on top, we can turn it. And we have two attachments that we can use. So if we move this forward, this lowers. You see, it goes down. And then if we move it back, it goes up. And included, we have these two attachments right here. So we can use something like this and attach it right here. And now we can be grabbing things with our crane. Over here, we have this small little lever. If we slide it to the left or to the right, we can close or open this claw. So we have this attachment, or if we would like, we also have another one that looks like this. Now this one is important because we can use this right here. We can slide this out. Oops. Like this and we can now attach this to this piece and it's a second attachment that we have so we can use this or this one right here so this is pretty cool over here is our sounds and lights of course the crane itself the top which we can rotate and turn and then in the back, we also have an elevator right over here. So we can put rubble right over here on the elevator and now make him go up. So he can go up right here to this floor or he could go all the way to the top right here. And in fact, we can even place him in the crane itself all the way on top that's pretty cool and over here this is where we're going to be doing the molds and of course we have kinetic sand two colors so we're going to place the kinetic sand into our molds and then place them right over here we can slide this in so we're going to slide this in and then we're going to press it down I just want to show you a little bit from up close how these molds look like. So here we have our kinetic sand and ooh, do I always love kinetic sand. It just, oh, it falls apart so nicely. But we take some of this kinetic sand and we place them into our molds. And then we place the molds right over here and then press this lever down. Put some pressure on it. And then once it goes up, there it is. We have our mold. Check this out. So then we can take something like this plastic knife, kid's knife, or anything a little bit that has an edge and just scrape away the sides. And there it is, here is our mold.
looks good. So we can do four different molds, like I mentioned earlier. Oh, here comes Marshall. Whoa, Rubble, what a cool crane you got up there. Wow, and it's so tall. Hey, listen, would you be able to build a small little garage for my car, my fire truck? That would be really great if you can do so. No problem, Marshall. I am on it. Okay, guys, so let's help Rubble build a garage for Marshall's fire truck. So first, let's pick up some kinetic sand. After all, we do have a bulldozer. There is some, and now let's bring it to this side right here. Let's dump it. And our crane will do the rest. So let's see, we need to pick this up. So let's use this attachment right here. Let's put this in here. Let's lower. And now we can twist it and pick up this piece of sand. Let's see. Can we do it? There we go. Let's open the arm. Great, it's inside and now let's close it. Perfect, we got it. Nice. Okay, now that we got our sand, let's slide this open and transfer everything to this location right here. Let's lower it. Now let's open up the arm. Nice. Okay, and now let's slide it back into position. Perfect. Our piece of sand is now ready for the molds. So let's see. Hmm. Let's do the walls first. So it's going to be this one right here. Let's use this mold. We got to do a little bit of a shake. Come on. There we go. All right, let's see. Whoa. Perfect. Beautiful. Okay, let's place it back here. And now let's slide this out. And now let's change the ending of our crane. Ah, there we go. To this one right here. So let's pop this one in. Oh, there we go. And now here in the back, we can close this. It snapped into place and we can pick it up with our crane. Oh, we got it. Let's raise it up. And our first piece of mold is complete. Beautiful. You see, we can play a game like this with the mold. So now let's do this few more times and let's build up that small little garage for Marshall's fire truck. We are busy working on Marshall's garage and take a look at all these molds that we have completed. Oh, that's right. Rubble is doing most of the work. At this point, he's right there operating the crane. So I cannot forget about him. But we are almost done with Marshall's garage. Okay, so take a look at this garage that me and Rumble have built. So we use the molds to build the walls on the side and also the floor. So right here, I squished it just a little bit to make sort of like a driveway for Marshall. There we go. And here is our garage. So maybe I'm also going to place some plants right over here. And we have one more mold, which I did in this shape right here. So what I want to do from this is build a bench right next to this garage. So we have these four sections right here. We're going to cut away two of them right along these lines. So one and number two, like this. So now let's just scrape off the sides so that it's nice and straight. Okay, so this is the part that we're gonna sit on. Here is going to be the back. So it's going to look like this. And now we just need to install the bottom part, the legs themselves. So we're gonna take this part and cut it into equal four parts. So let's see. Now that we have cut it into four equal pieces, we're just going to put them right here at the bottom. And there it is. We have our small little bench that we can now place next to this plant and the garage itself. 
So here's how it looks from up close. Again, it's nothing fancy, but hey, it does look pretty good. I like it. Let's see if Marshall is gonna like it. Wow, I love it. This is fantastic. Let's see. Will it fit? Oh, this is just perfect. Just the right size for Marshall. <laughs> nice. Thank you so much, Rubble. This was awesome. So I hope all of you enjoyed this video as well. And you see, we can have lots of fun with kinetic sand, build different structures, shapes, and this cool new toy from Paw Patrol, the crane. And of course, I had lots of help from Rubble himself. So thank you all so much for spending these few minutes with me. And I hope you're staying safe. And like always, be good, and I will see you soon in another video where we take a look at another toy. Bye-bye, everyone.